Good morning, boys and girls from third grade. We're going to start our new lesson. Buenos días, niños y niñas de tercer grado. Vamos a empezar con nuestra siguiente lección. Today's lesson topic is what is this? El tema es qué es esto? O or what is it? ¿Qué es esto? Los dos significan lo mismo. What is this? O what is it? Significa qué es esto. ¿Ok? Repeat right after me. Repitan después de mí. What is this? What is it? Otra vez. What is this? What is it. ¿Qué significa what is this or what is it? Significa que es esto. All right, let's continue with the next part. What is it? Repitan. What is it? Y la respuesta va a ser It is the sun. What is it? It is the sun. Ok, repitan junto conmigo. What is it? It is the sun. Excellent. Now, what is it? What is it? What is it? It is the heart. It is the heart. Y la siguiente. What is it? It is the star. It is the star. Alright, let's do it one more time. What is it? This is the sun. Oh, it is the sun. Perdón. What? Is it? It is the heart. Heart. Esta letra como que no tiene sonido. Heart. What is the, it? It is the star. Alright, let's continue now. Let's review them again, but now using what is this. Vamos a analizarlos de nuevo, pero ahora utilizando el what is this. Ok. So, we said, tenemos que preguntar, what is this? ¿Otra vez? What is this? This is the sun. Acuérdense, cuando preguntamos what is this, la respuesta tiene que ser this también. Cuando preguntamos what is it? La respuesta va a ser y también, ¿ok? Es it con it o this con this. All right. So, in this one, what is this? This is the sun. All right. Let's continue with the next one and repeat right after me. What is this? This is the heart. This is the heart. Right, let's do it again. What is this? This is the star. This. All right, let's repeat them again. Yo lo digo primero y usted lo repite después de mí. What is this? This is the sun. Otra vez. What is this? This is the sun. Now, what is this? This is the heart. What is this? This is the heart. And the last one. What is this? This is the star. What is this? This is the start. Excellent. So far. So let's continue the next exercise.
Now we're gonna practice again with what is it. ¿Qué dijimos que significa what is it? Significa que es esto, ¿verdad? Ok. Entonces vamos a preguntar. What is it? What is it? Y la respuesta tiene que ser con it, ¿verdad? It is the moon. It is the moon. What is it? It is the moon. <coughs> Next. What is it? What is it? It is the flag. It is the flag. What is it? It is the flag. Next one. What is it? What is it? It is the cloud. It is the cloud. All right, let's do it one more time. I'll do it first and you repeat it after me. Yo lo digo primero y ustedes después de mí. What is it? It is the moon. What is it? It is the flag. What is it? It is the cloud. Excellent. Now let's practice them using this. What is this? This is the moon. Okay. What is this? This is the moon. What is this? This is the flag. What is this? This is the flag. What is this? This is the moon. What is this? This is the moon, the cloud, perdón. This is the cloud. Let's repeat it one more time. The number one. What is this? This is the moon. What is this? This is the flag. What is this? This is the cloud. Excellent. Now, let's continue with the next point. Digamos con la siguiente parte. What is this? ¿Qué será esto? Esto es un anuncio, ¿verdad? Well, in English is this is an advertisement. Remember? Because I ask this. What is this? Como yo pregunté, what is this? La respuesta tiene que empezar con this, ¿verdad? Si hubiera preguntado, what is it? It is an advertisement. But in this case, what is this? The answer is, this is an advertisement. Okay? Try to repeat it right after me. This, repita después de mí. This is an advertisement 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 excellent <clears throat> let's analyze which are the parts of an advertisement vamos a analizar cuáles son las partes que componen un anuncio por ejemplo aquí tenemos esta parte cómo se llama esta parte cómo se llama esta ¿Cómo se llama esta parte? ¿Cómo se llama esta? What about this name? How do you name, do we name this? And how do we name this? So all these different parts of an advertisement, we're going to analyze them. Todas estas partes de un anuncio las vamos a analizar. So let's start. Just remember, this is an advertisement. Okay, the first part of an advertisement is... What is this? This is the logo. What is the logo? That one. That we call logo. 
like this part is called logo okay si yo les pregunto what is this the answer is this is the logo all right les voy a preguntar what is this this is the logo now what is this what is this and the answer is this is the place this is the place okay so we have so far two different parts of an, an advertisement hasta ahorita tenemos dos partes de un anuncio que es el logo and the place okay logo place what is this this is the logo what is this this is the place all right let's continue now with the next part la part the part number three dice what is this ¿Qué será eso? what is this and the answer is this is an invitation repeat after me this is an invitation otra vez repeat after me this is an invitation excellent next point the number four what is this what is this and the answer is this is the date this is the date okay this is the date okay i'll say it first you repeat it after me what is this this is the date notice that this letter has no sound fíjense que esta letra no tiene sonido okay date vamos a empezar con la parte de arriba what is this this is an invitation la number four what is this this is the date All right excellent let's continue with the next part what is this and the answer is this is the time this is the time remember it has it has no sound the letter has no sound esta letra no tiene sonido so what is this this is the time excellent so let's review them again vamos a verlas de nuevo la number three i'll say it first you repeat it after me yo lo digo primero y usted lo repite después de mí what is this this is an invitation this is an invitation or oh, this is the invitation the number four what is this uh, this is the date this is the date y la number five what is this this is the time this is the time excellent so we have already reviewed five points of an advertisement we're going to co to continue with the other ones hasta ahorita hemos visto cinco puntos de un anuncio vamos a, hacer, a ver la siguiente the number six what is this and the answer this is an image image this is the image this is the image okay and finally then bueno yo lo digo primero and you repeat it after me what is this this is the image image y la number seven what is this this is the coast this is the price okay this is the price the cost is the price okay again yo lo digo primero what is this this is the price all right so let's repeat the number six 
and then the number seven. What is this? This is the image. This is the image. And now, what's, what is this? This is the price. This is the price. Excellent. Let's review a little bit more. The number eight. What is this? What is this? The purpose. This is the purpose. This is the purpose. Repeat after me. What is this? This is the purpose. All right, excellent. Let's take a look of the different parts of an advertisement that we have reviewed so far or we have learned so far. Vamos a aprendernos las partes de un anuncio que nos hemos aprendido o hemos visto hasta ahorita. We have this. Do you remember how do we call this? Is the that's the logo. Do you remember how do we call that part? ¿Se acuerdan cómo se llama esa parte? The place. Excellent. The logo. The place. Do you remember how do we call that part? ¿Se acuerdan cómo, uh, cómo se llama esa parte en English? Se llama the invitation. The invitation. Do you remember how do we call this part? ¿Se acuerdan cómo nombramos esa parte? We called it the date. The date. Do you remember how do we call this part? Do you remember? We called it the time. The time. Do you remember how do we call this part? The image. The image. Excellent. Do you remember how do we call this part? The price. The price. And do you remember how do we call this part? The purpose. The purpose. Excellent. So let's now continue. Remember, this is an advertisement que también se le llama ad, es decir, eh, abreviamos la palabra y también está bien dicha y bien escrita. The advertisement is the long form. The advertisement es la forma larga and the ad is the short version. It, el, the ad es la versión cortita, ¿verdad? And all this, this is an the advertisement, ¿verdad? Muy bien. De tarea, ustedes van a hacer en su libreta o en una hoja de, mani, de máquina este anuncio. Pero le van a poner las partes que, que cómo se llama cada parte del anuncio. For homework, you're going to do in your notebook or on a piece of paper this advertisement. But you want to have to write down the names of each part of the announcement. For example, once you draw this, una vez que ustedes dibujen esto, por ejemplo, la van a escribir en, este, en frente como se llama esto. Entonces dijimos que es logo, ¿verdad? This is the logo. O it is the logo. O nomás escriben la palabra de la parte que corresponde. Logo. Now, do you remember this part? How do we call this part? Okay, we said place, ¿verdad? Y van a escribir en un ladito la palabra place. If you want it, also you can do it in Spanish and in English. Si quieren, lo pueden poner en inglés y en español como ustedes gusten. Si no, solamente en inglés está bien. Do you remember, for example, how do we call this part? ¿Recuerdan cómo se llamaba esta? Y lo van a anotar. That's going to be part of your homework. Eso va a ser parte 
de su tarea. Muchas gracias.